maybe if you could just break it down for us. How does one become a Freemason? Yes. Um, first is uh, uh, when you get to hear about it and you are lucky to be get to get in there. I'm saying lucky in the sense that unless you get to know about it from somebody else, you may never be interested in it. And in particular, with these negative attitudes that are being propagated by ignorant people, uh, you never hear about it. So somebody who is an insider, like I have been there from 1994, uh, I would find it something good, something that you would want to invite a friend of yours. So I might say that, look, uh, Mr. Haim, I'm looking at you. I think you're a very good man because it's about good people. It's, you're a good man. You're, you like charity work. You like helping people and all kind of things. So I will tell you, Mr. Haimba, would you mind my introducing you to this? Then I will give you a, a little bit of a talk. And uh, after that, um, I would then propose, I would go to a meeting and propose that I have somebody who should, I think I should introduce. You were then invited for an interview. We talked to you about a few things. In particular, we are concerned about your family, what your family will think about you because of all these negative things. Uh, if there's any objection from uh, so it will then be announced it's just like uh, publishing a, a, a publication for a, for a wedding so we'll say okay anybody with an objection so it will go on you'll be there for some time that i'm proposing it will openly propose and we give time to anybody who objects if there's anybody who objects then you will not come in mm -hmm. and the objection will be somebody who knows you have negative character so from there, you will, if there is no objection, you will be initiated. You will be brought in and uh, welcomed and shown what it is all about.